Yes. If you wouldn't mind running through uh, some of the rules for our streamer folks and um, okay, just basically it's a tutorial. Why don't you stand on this side? Oh, I'm so sorry. You, well, just yeah, yeah. Camera. Sorry. Oh. Uh, have, we, have we started already? Oh, well, well, it's, it's been going. It's, it's been going. Right. Yeah. In that case, I didn't yeah. know. Just run through. A well, the interesting rules. thing. All right. Yeah. Uh, for those who can see the play field, and I guess you can. Uh, the way that we uh, program for the lights kind of tells you what the game is. Right. So it was a walkthrough to start with. And uh, the basic premise of the game is getting the drop target down, drop target banks down. One or the other, which is going to, depending on settings, is going to uh, get you into uh, opportunity where the, uh, the lock is lit up on top. And pound away in multi-ball. You get 2x play field scoring. So the premise, all right, premise really simple. <clears throat> Complete the banks. Complete the stand-ups behind it. You're going to light the center. When the center is lit and you have both lights lit, hit that target, and you get your monster bonus. Monster bonus is a carryover. What I never wanted to do with any game that I was ever involved with or any games that I might have been around when they were in development, I never wanted the game to max out. I always wanted something to be alive. So if you take a look at this, I can get my multipliers. You can continually monster. add to it as you, because you got to hit them all down, which it's hard it's enough to just hit them all down right. in one game. But then you have to do it again to and add again, another, and again. Point, another one and another one. Exactly. Yep. One. And then and you have your regular bonus, which is... Uh, regular bonus is just, just completing the phase. Right. Okay. But I wanted there to still be an incentive. So in effect, what are we looking at? We're looking at eight drop targets. Right now. But not really. We're looking at 16 targets. Right. It's cool. I have a designer. So it's a 16 target game. And then the eyes. I always like having some kind of a ball it's been right a there. Game. And that has its own. And that's for completing that gets your extra ball. It's an extra ball, right? Uh, it can. And what I'm doing is adding with that. I didn't know how this is. Oh, so each time you hit it. Uh, right. I'm going to increase when I'm completing it to get to the top score. No, extra ball? Extra ball is actually getting both banks. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. So when I can get both banks, then I have a rotating extra ball possibility. Okay, so is that and the eyes then? By completing eyes? No. No. I mean, the eyes are standalone on their own. Okay. Okay. That's just there because it's a nice shot. Okay. My sons have commented, I wish you would have done more with it. Like, well, I mean, we're so talking about a 1985 game. There's only so much that you can So when you match out eyes, that's 100 shallow. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And then that, um, and that will cash in at the end of the ball? No. Immediately. Immediately. Okay. Right. Okay. Now, the other part. Let's not forget the spinners. Oh, and you can double up on extra balls too, yeah. right? Yeah, yes. so by hitting those, because then they dance around. Right. Um, and that's uh, CPU control, not switch control, right? They just, they move on their own. They're moving on their own, yep. right. It's not a switch. Yep. So you have so to try to time it. Just when you're ready to hit it, because it's there, yep. it's gone. Yep. And, and you can cradle and wait. I mean, we didn't think of cradling back then. But, uh, yeah. And you got one, two, three, four, five, six places that it can move to. Right. Away from you. Yep. And then the only other thing I was going to mention is I have carryovers here in terms of having bonus in the bank. I always liked that in terms of what Bally had done with games like Kiss back in 1980 and others, where you had Colossal Bonus and what have you. And my string can go up to... Uh, a fairly significant amount. So there's that, and then I started to say spinners. All right. Complete a bank. Go from whatever it is. Let's say the baseline is 100 points or 10 points to lift value. So I can increase up to 3,000 per spin. Thank you. Without my taking off my glasses to see. And, which and if I am in uh, 2x play field scoring. <clears throat> yeah, that can kind of really yeah. add up. Yeah, you rip in two, and, two and spinners on the game with multi ball going. Right. You can really, I mean, if you if you got that shot down. Um, and I also notice 
I find it a little easier to go after this one because it's a little yeah. more open with this, this, upper, this upper flipper here. Um, yes. And that's meant to bash these, capitalize Absolutely. on that. Right. Okay. Yep. I was curious, what is this open spot underneath the plastic? What, why is that? Just a little place where if something gets hung up or whatever else, I can roll back down and out. Okay. So if I'm popping off the jet, I want to make sure you go there and it wasn't just hitting rubber. It's okay. dead because there's no switch there. Okay. So think of it as a little escape area, right. if you will. But the whole the whole premise of design the game, the way that I did it was, I wanted to have some balance like this. Obviously, in my first game with Sharpshooter, I tend to be very reliant with everything being on the left in terms of the target thing. Here I wanted something that had some flow, and I like the shots that come from here, bounce off to here. And there's always, the, that's another thing I love about this game, is there's always something to go after no matter which angle you're at, yes. and you have to be quick, especially with this pop bumper down here, <laughs> to, to really just just go on the fly. Um, well, and, and time it in such a way where you're not just draining. Right, exactly. Because, uh, let's face it, I mean, this can be a long playing game. Yeah, uh, yeah. If you if you get in the zone, and then also the, the way that you design the geometry of it, what we talked earlier about the the C um, drop right. target being almost impossible to get. Uh, you have to go it's right, right right off the tip. Of the or what you're going to get is off of a sling. A sling. Yep. Uh, I, I mean, I've always wanted helpers. If you will, yep. if I'm not able to make that shot, I may get a bounce off of that and suddenly I get my monster bonus and it yep. hurts. Because let's face it, having a target dead center is murder. Oh, yeah. But the reward is there. Right. So after you do the hard work of dropping down all of your drops, getting all your stand ups, then you evenly put the cash in right in the middle that almost always just sends it straight back at you. It can if you're really, <laughs> really precise, but I have a couple of posts on either side to help you. And depending on how that target is uh, staged, I mean, you don't have to hit it dead on. Right, right. So I'm not, I'm not being totally unkind and totally brutal in regard to uh, what I was thinking. But again, I wanted a game that had good side-to-side -side action, good up-and-down action. I always like the idea of having a real long shot, so you have the lock shot all the way up on top, and that's just a sweet feeling when you can make it. Oh, and it's and it's uh, just the, the feeling of that shot because it's it's hard to get. Uh -huh. I mean, uh, uh, Jeff Fuel was just saying, uh, you know how I get that spinner shot is I aim over here <laughs> <laughs> because it, you know it's threading the needle because you have to be dead on right. For it to fire up there and have enough momentum to get into the shot. Right. Um, so. Or if it's lit, thumbing it off the plunger and having it bounce and then roll back in as a gift. So that's that's the nature of the game. Yeah. Well, I really appreciate you going through the rules and talking through it. Uh, My pleasure. Yeah, yeah. Do I get a chance to play a game? Yeah, See yeah, how it plays? yeah. Go for it. You can do number one. Am I putting in multiple players? I'm gonna put, just put four on it, we'll get a four going. There you go. Perfect. Thank you, I wanted that one. Should have nudged, but I'm set up. All right. Good first call. Quick hug. I'm not even like, quick hug. Oh, Only remember to keep away. Looks like you were seeing like a strange, like, who are you? Why are you hugging? Oh, yes, yeah, so I was ready. We're ready. Good to see you. Good to see you. Oh, it has to drain somewhere. 
was out of my control. Well, they gotta find it. So. Try this twice. Which one? Get this spinner. Oh, the left spinner shot? Yeah. Yeah, that's. It wasn't where I thought it was gonna be. But you can see the result. Yep, yep, that's a little old. Yep. To that foot. Ah. There you go. No, 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 no. Hey, Internet. If you don't know, this guy here is what's his toes. Yep. I had to actually, somebody cut it off of there. Yeah, so I actually had to cut it off of there. It's a spool valve, right? Yeah. And so I found the exact replacement. So I had to. Cool. Okay. Oh wow. Okay. That's not working. Nope. Oh wait, they're all morning. Why, why didn't you just dead flip? Them? <laughs> Come on, we see your sons. You know how they play. <laughs> You're trying to reverse to what? <laughs> Thank you for the, the uh, understanding. Oh. Oh, sure. I, I mean, I, luck. Thanks. All luck, that's it. No, I'll try to line up a bunch of better. <laughs> That's about the only other way to get the line. Oh my goodness. Lucky bounce. Oh, it's handy. Player four. Oh, I know, the glare. Oh, no, that camera went dead. Fix the play field camera as soon as his ball drains, guys. Shouldn't take a minute. Yeah, I just gotta, I just gotta see how like tilted. So how many of these have you been to so far? I typically would come Friday and Saturday, like I did this time, but I would never stay over time. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> I would go Thursday night and crash it. Yeah, Roger, if you don't mind, I'm going to fix the camera real quick because it moved. Oh, I apologize. Not to worry. And the way I have played this so far, if you can turn it off, it's fine too. <laughs> no, just just kidding. Thank you. Yes. Nope, too soon. That's embarrassing.
You may play as long as you like. We're we're by no means telling you to go away. Okay. <laughs> you can go away in your home. <laughs> okay. I, I, had, I had three tries at it. I was too early, too late. I always hate it when I don't. I have. Thank you. All right, it's there. The shot is there. Thank you. <clears throat> Just in the nick of time. And double play as well. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you. At least in bonus ball, I was able to make the spin. Thank God. <laughs> Thanks, Roger. Definitely. Yeah. I'll try to stop there. Yeah. Thank you. Greatly appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Enjoy. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Guys, we go. We will.